what's up everybody welcome or welcome back to my channel as you guys can see by the title i'm starting a new show today which is killing eve this wasn't really a recommendation it was kind of just out of my own curiosity i guess because i've heard a lot about this show i just know that a lot of people like the show so i'm like why not might as well react to it because i want to see what's uh what's going on in this show really if i'm being honest i really want to watch it because of sandra O oh and as a Grey's Anatomy fan, of course, I love Sandra O. Oh. Yeah, that's probably one of the main reasons why I'm going to be watching it. And also because it's an HBO show. All HBO shows are good. So yeah, I don't really want to talk too much. I really just want to get into the episode and see what it's all about. So we're going to do that. Vienna. It's a little bit odd. Cause I'm blood. <laughs> Hold the fuck? <laughs> Oh my god, I missed her. Yeah. Well, at least we have the whole weekend to look Oh my god. Oh my Saturday, god. You were superb last night. Right. Everyone's in there with Frank. Oh, I just want to put it out there that I have no idea what this show is about. Well, thank you all for giving us your Saturday. Turns out people are still murderous bastards on the weekend. <laughs> Good morning. Yeah, not now. There's been an assassination in Vienna. He was digging for about a minute before he collapsed. Cool. He was picked up in Hammersmith this morning and needs protection. Sorry? Sorry. No. Why is she just giving me Christina vibes right now? I imagine the girl is uh, quite traumatized. He's the only witness. I said it was probably a woman. Victor Kedron was a misogynist and a sex trafficker. He may not have considered a passing woman a threat. She must have been able to get close. Give me the rest of that or I'll fire you. So what is she like? Uh, oh wait, well, she's an assistant, she right? But oh, what is MI5 though? I don't know what that is. Sorry if I'm supposed to, but I don't. Paris. Oh, now she has blender. She's really pretty though. <laughs> Who is this girl? She's kind of weird. Just a little bit. You're gorgeous. Stop it. Beautiful. Oh, okay. At least she knows. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm sorry. What are we doing? <laughs> yeah, I was just about to say that. I like her. Good. They want me to give you this. Money. And they want you to do another job tomorrow. All information is on there? Sure. Tuscany will be beautiful right now. You want to go? No. Oh, is she like a, a hit girl nice, or nice. what's... I don't know what the proper term is. Yeah, I feel like she is in that. Oh, okay. Killing Eve. Okay. Mm. Oh, Jesus, that's good. 
Yeah. What do they want her overnight? Uh, don't know. They haven't transferred her from the station yet. Yeah. Apparently she's a bit of a character. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop down there quickly. Why? Did we sing Disney? Yeah. yeah. Duh. Where are you going? To the bathroom. CCTV from Vienna turned up. It was a bloke. What? What? Since the meeting? Yeah. There's a difference between thinking it was a woman and wanting it to be a woman. It was a woman, right? I'm going to try to throw up. I suggest you do too. Get her tea. tea? Like that's gonna help. I have no idea what she's speaking. Get your ass into bed. Oh! That's cute. My uncle's Polish. How are you? Oh, I thought you'd be straight to bed. Uh, just the description of the person she saw while she was on the street. Tall. Dark. <laughs> Tall and dark. Is she talking about the girl? Small breasts. Black chest. Like a plank. Oh my god. The girl, right? The killer was a small breasted psycho, apparently. Nah, it was her. It was Villanelle. I think it was. Cause she was in Vienna. So right? I was counting on you not having a life. Can you pull Margit Paulson from the registry? An assassin. Uh, how big are her tits? Breast. Okay, I know you're into assassins, but I refuse to talk about them this way. <laughs> you know, Elena. Massive. All our hotlines are completely confidential, madam. <laughs> kind of badass though. Oh, she's there. It's too, too skinny. Shit, I don't know how to say that. Damn, so she's a whole assassin. <laughs> Come through body. Okay. Jesus, the upper body strength that I do not have. Whew. Security as shit. <laughs> she climbed up the side of the house. Oh, did you have kids? Come on. Well, assassins don't care, right? Oh my god. Shit, why did she close the cupboard? I know damn well. <laughs> How the fuck did she get in there? Girl. Okay, no, I like her. Just walks up into the party. Not sus at all. Does she speak every language? Oh. <laughs> Shit, she's using the kid? Oh my god. Aloha. Okay, no, but he looks so sweet and like innocent. Oof. Whoa. How is she just okay? Fuck. I think she actually likes this. Jesus. Uh huh. All that from a tiny puncture. It's so impressive. How would you kill me if you could? 
Um, what? Who asked that type of question? Push it down the stand. I paralyze you with saxotoxin and suffocate you in your sleep. Chop you into the smallest bits I can manage. Boil you down, put you in a blender, and take you to work in a flask and flush you down a restaurant toilet. You really thought about that? <laughs> Smart, huh? But honey, do you want supper? Ooh. Yes, thank you. Do you want to have sex? True. <laughs> do you know someone is lying about the CCTV? Bill. I didn't tell him. I need to get more, and I need her consent to record her. She should have been a spy. That'd be awesome if she was a spy. After all, everybody. Do you think you could excuse your guests? Well, shit. Oh, well. The politician's girlfriend was reportedly with him while he died and was not harmed. Not so good. He would be interviewed as a principal witness to the murder. Wait, why? Damn. To be an assassin. So, the Kevin assassin was a woman. There was CCTV. No, 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 no. See, there wasn't any CCTV until after I suggested it might be a woman. Kasha is the only lead we have, and tomorrow morning she's someone else's witness. It's weird. Our job is weird. Sorry if your husband is boring you too, but that doesn't give you an excuse to go rogue and work. <coughs> Make sure your witness is cozy and safe. Is this legal? No. <laughs> no. Are you alright? Damn. She's like, mm. Mm -hmm. I know that look. It's annoying me, but you were right. We've been bullshit. Keep that girl safe. Shit, oh my god, she's in there. I didn't even realize. Oh my god, she killed everybody. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god, oh god, oh my god. Oh god, oh god. stay with me. This girl killed the whole floor. Stay with me. Stay with me. No, 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 no. Dude. If they fire you, you'd better drag me down with you. Been looking for an excuse to call Frank a dick swap for years. I'm the dick swap. I should I don't want to say you only had one job. Oh, piss off, Frank. Fuck you. On top of that, you failed at your actual job. No doubt because you were so busy executing your pretend job. The case. most important thing is that I was right no, about the fact No, the most important thing, Eve, is that four people are dead and it's all your fault. It's not her fault. How do you Edward, know that? Because I secretly recorded the interview and brought it home and asked Dom and my husband to translate it for me. You're fine. You're a dick swab. Oh, I Thank you, Bill. No, I was going to call you a dick swab. If I both of them? There's going to be some reshuffling in your department. I suggest you both leave immediately. Fuck this guy. Because he just doesn't want to listen. Eve. What are you doing here? Do you think she's been operating for two years across ten countries? She's highly skilled, but as yet untraceable, and frankly, she's starting to show off. At the Purple Penguin restaurant by Charing Cross. Thursday, 9 a.m. I'll wait for ten minutes. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Why do people think we're having affairs before they think we're secret agents? You might want to make them think you're having an affair then. Well, yeah. <laughs> Gotta keep that shit a secret. <laughs> she took the blanket. This girl. Oh, no, she got it. Okay, sorry, my bad. Bulgaria. Okay. okay so that was Killing Eve Season 1, Episode 1. Um, it was a little bit confusing in the beginning, I'm not gonna lie. But of course, as like the episode progressed, it got a little bit more easier to understand what was going on. So Villanelle is a female, like obviously she's female. Okay, she's an assassin who like travels all over the world, you know, killing people. I don't know if they're um, like just bad people or she's just like, well, I mean, I guess they have to be bad, right? Because why else would she just be killing like random innocent people? That wouldn't make sense. So I guess they all have their own like, you know, backstory and their whatever they did. So Eve is, is she an agent? I don't know what she is because she's fired now. But before that, she was just like an assistant 
asked, but I don't I don't know what the proper term is if you guys could correct me in the comments. But yes, Eve is basically investigating all these murders that Villanelle is doing. Sorry guys if I say her name wrong, Cassia. She was the one who um was basically like the only tied to prove that Villanelle's a girl and that she's not a male assassin which is like important so that they could figure out you know that it's Villanelle. Eve is like you know she's on top of her shit she's like really investigating it and she wants to prove that she's right of course she's on the right track we know that like or you guys already watched this but watching the show we know that she is right but i mean she got fired anyways that's basically all that really happened in this first episode it was just i guess a brief kind of um introduction to what the show's gonna be about and the characters um the guy that villanelle was with in paris i don't i guess that's like her boss or something i'm not sure who he is either she didn't there was no mention of what he is to her no family of uh villanelle so far that we've seen simply just know that her name's Villanelle and that she is an assassin. So yeah, hopefully in the next episode we're gonna like, you know, pick up a little bit, find more information, I guess, on like all of the cases that Villanelle has, you know, or the murders that she's committed and like, you know, really put the pieces together for Eve and, and Bill and, you know, hopefully they get closer to finding her and I want to see what's gonna happen. They had their little, I guess, first meeting encounter and um, I'm just gonna say it from now just because I know like the way that she looked at her from watching so much tv and just you know villanelle was looking at eve like like she was like hmm let me try and do it hold up hold up yeah <laughs> that's what she was looking at her maybe in the future episodes might have a thing for eve i feel like that's super far-fetched because it's just like the first episode but i don't know it's just a theory so that is it. If you guys like these types of videos, make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Be sure to check out my other videos on my channel. I've been reacting to Game of Thrones, The Boys, The Flash. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching.